An expert in North Korea says the South Korean government's envisioned reunification plan is nothing more than a pipe dream. He's urging Seoul to consider scaling down its grand plans for a unified Korea. Kim Hyun-bin reports on Gregory Toliaria's views. A Russian expert on North Korean affairs has labeled South Korea's reunification plans unrealistic. Gregory Toleraya, a senior researcher at Russia's Academy of Sciences, says there's hardly any chance of Seoul's three-step unification plan being realized. South Korea's plan is based on North Korea's denuclearization, inter-Korean reconciliation, and fostering international support. Toleraya says the North Korean regime is less likely to collapse now than it was in the 1990s. And even if it did, the chances of it peacefully disbanding and coming under the wing of South Korea are slim to none. The expert says the current political structure in North Korea shouldn't be seen as a dictatorship, but rather as a monarchy, under which another figurehead will take the reins if the Kim family line falls. Toleraya says Seoul needs to consider geopolitical factors and change its all-around approach to the North, while convincing Washington to do the same. Meanwhile, Russia's ambassador to South Korea, Alexander Timonen, said on Thursday that international pressure would not make the regime abandon its nuclear program. He emphasized the issue should be settled through the swift resumption of the six-party talks that aim to denuclearize North Korea in exchange for economic and political aid. The six-party talks made up of two Koreas, the U.S., China, Japan, and Russia, have been stalled since late 2008. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.